No one excelled at the cameo technique like George Woodall. His work at Thomas Webber's factory is really outstanding and we're fortunate in the sale to have perhaps one of his masterpieces. Uh, indeed, it was perhaps one of his favourite pieces. As he owned an almost identical vase himself. He called it the origin of painting. The vase tells a story from Greek mythology. The lovers, Ariston and Philae, are shown inventing painting. And it really plays to George Woodall's love of light and shadow. For the lamp is casting a light shadow of the face of Ariston onto the pillar. And here his lover is drawing his face so that as he grows old, she will always be forever reminded of his youthful good looks. And uh, captured here by Woodall in the cameo glass, he had developed this wonderful opaline blue-white colour and shading it bit by bit, carving it away to show that light and dark and shadow it really is mesmerising and this is a truly beautiful vase. When Webbs exhibited in Adelaide in the exhibition in 1887, they sold this vase for a rumoured 100 guineas, which was an incredible sum of money at the time. Then just look at it and you can understand why. It's decorated all the way around. Uh, exotic plants blend into well, a different view on every angle. The decoration on the back hummingbirds flying around, more exotic vegetation, and it's all carved within these few millimetres of glass. Woodall called this vase Clochis. It depicts a classical maiden, and he's given her a diaphanous dress which clings to her body, leaving her beauty with really nothing left for the imagination and all within just one or two millimetres of glass. I mean, one wonders how on earth he did it. This was back in the 1890s. Um, at the time, uh, Woodall would have earned probably about six pounds for making that vase, and they were sold for a lot of money. While his collection of vases looks dramatic in Bonham's catalogue of fine glass on the 18th of May, photographs alone don't begin to do justice to English cameo glass you have to get right up close to it to appreciate the artistry and skill that went into every piece. 